probabilitymanager.org is proud to announce the 3.0 SIPMATH standard. Think of this as the AC current of the probability power grid. And the first 3.0 power plant is Analytic Solver from Frontline Systems. Special thanks to Dan Fiostra, CEO of Frontline. This is certainly not his first rodeo. He created the Excel Solver that's built into Excel. Many of you have used that. And before that, he co-founded Visicorp, which marketed Visicalc, the very first electronic spreadsheet. Here's how it works. I'm in an analytic solver model. I've got simulation turned on. And we are simulating a sales forecast here. Now, there's a 30% chance of a new account coming in. And that's going to, of course, bolster our sales. You can see by that second bump there. Now, what I'm going to do is export this probability distribution from Solver so that we can use it in other simulations with precisely the same set of simulation trials. So the first step here was to fit a metalog function uh, to that distribution. And, and here you can see uh, the, the fitted metalog. Next, we're going to deploy the model. I could deploy it to the cloud or Power BI or a bunch of other places. In this case, I'm just going to do a quick test uh, and uh, save it to my desktop as a probability model. So this is a snippet of a JSON here, a structured data format. It contains the parameters of an HDR. Those are the seeds for the HDR. It contains the coefficients of uh, a metal log. And this little snippet of code will produce exactly the same random number stream in Analytic Solver, in ChanceCalc, in Python, in R, and if you have the patience, on an abacus. So now we're going to use the distribution of demand that we simulated in Analytic Solver in a ChanceCalc model. So let's open that distribution of demand that we calculated uh, in Analytic Solver. There's the library name, and then uh, there's the demand forecast, and I click OK, and well, there it is. I remember that little guy. There's that bimodal distribution. And let's see, we've got a bunch of trials in here, right? I've got trial one, trial two, trial three, as many trials as I want. By the way, they will be exactly the same trials that come out of Analytic Solver.